Bim Bim, we're um, creating art experiences that bring people into self-exploration. And this one is about making a journey through life. I am Com, and I'm welcoming the participants into the first stage, the childhood, and I'm here to reconnect them through a guided meditation to their childhood memory, especially their childhood bedroom, where a lot of memory arise, a lot of possibilities in a particular feeling, something to make them more aware, to expand their consciousness and their availability to receive and make the most out of everything that's awaiting for them. And I'm Julie, so I'm following Com uh, in this, uh, on this playground and I'm offering people a chance to play together. So we are playing uh, improvisation theater warm-ups. It raises the energy, people get into their bodies and they get a sense of play. Cool, I think we're starting right now. Okay. <laughs> when I take the word ego and relaxation, uh, why, do, why do I need to relax my ego? I don't, I don't have any crazy ego. I will try to, to, to be part of it at 100% of, of, of me and uh, give everything I can. I'm extremely excited about this. I'm just yeah, really waiting to see, finally experience it and yeah, it's going to be great. Yeah. How, how do you feel? Do you feel nervous? Do you I'm feel just excited? Curious. curious. A little nervous. <laughs> <laughs> and do you have any... I'm saying curious, like, a bit excited and yeah, I don't know. I want to, to see. What, what's your expectation from it? What do you, what do you think is going to happen? Like, like go into my ego, you know? <laughs> That's the thing, no? <laughs> And okay. relax. <laughs> We're just inviting you to really let go, listen to your body, let loose, have some fun, move around, enjoy yourself. She whispers to the wind. She nurtures her gardens. Edens of serenity. It was very beautiful to see how in one hand they want to celebrate in the other hand they want to really feel deep inside of them trying to evoke um, connection between people and that the bodies will become a bit more permeable that the group will unite uh, so a little bit step out of this feeling of we are individual bodies and more stepping into collectiveness They come through this tunnel of smoke and they don't really know what's going on and then the drumming starts and they get shaking and then they are like, oh, okay, this is what's happening and then they start to let loose and it's, it's really amazing. Like here, for instance, to me the way, the way I relate to, to the ego is kind of a, a place where it's, it's safe that you can wear, take off your mask. It's kind of the backstage of your life too. Mm -hmm. and you don't have to pretend anymore and that's mm -hmm. the, the feeling or the vibe I think we're trying to create here. Yeah, it's really about relaxing your ego because the ego is um, all your memories, education, projections that might at some point become a prison for yourself. And if you want to like get more free so that you can um, achieve or experience more things in your life, then you relaxing your ego kind of like broaden your experience of life so that's what we're trying to 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 share with people today so here we are in the sanctuary the proposition here for them to end the journey uh, here of ego relaxation with a letter that they could write to themselves with the perspective of being older or maybe having done this whole journey we will post the letter in the following year and that's the whole game and purpose of it is that they came back to read this letter later they appreciated it and it also really connected it 
to themselves and also I saw couples or friends like kind of a it was like and then when we all come back in um, to see people being able to take that energy and turn it inwards and reflect is is really something beautiful and I've been I feel so privileged to have been a part of that part today Thank you.